Hi guys, uh, I'm Kevin Courtney. Um, this is my my uh, 2007 Honda S2000. Um, we're out here at, at, at Fontana Speedway enjoying the beautiful weather. Um, uh, I'm I'm also the driver of Kia's car. Uh, we we were out last week, uh, two weeks ago, at, at Global Time Attack. Um, I'm I guess you can consider me a, a semi-pro driver. Today here I'm out with my my, my weekend car and uh, just out there having fun. As, as far as the car goes, it's very mild. Um, uh, all this area you see is all done by me. I have uh, you know, hand make in my garage. This is a uh, uh, alumilite splitter. Um, it is uh, very, very strong, although the, you can actually step on it. Um, we're going 100, 130 miles an hour out there, and um, it's not coming, coming off yet. Uh, last time we were here for Redline, I had a, a similar incident where it came off, so I made sure this time this one's completely strong. The engine's very mild in tune, it's got an intake header exhaust with a, a Flash Pro uh, tune on it done by uh, Church Automotive in uh, Wilmington, I believe he's in Wilmington. Very, very basic, it makes uh, 267 to the wheels on a dyno pack, so um, oh, 180 um, foot pounds. Um, so it was really good for a Honda S2000. I've had this car for five years, and, and it's you know it's been bit slowly building, building, building. Um, it also runs on a, a, a Tain Super Racing coilover uh, with a, uh, a custom spring rate uh, from Swift. Um, a little bit too stiff for my liking. Um, I'm t I kind of want to back it out a little. It's a 20 kg, which is really stiff for uh, for the tires that I'm running. But the tires, you know, are 255 um, RS3 all the way around. Um, 17 by 9, um, so it's, it's a real wide, wide rim, it works real good, I, I love the non-staggered setups, it's, real, it's uh, real controllable under braking, uh, and also real controllable in an oversteer situation, so, which is really cool. Um, on the inside, it's just very basic, the office on the inside is very basic. I have a, a Bride Zeta 3 that just my old workhorse seats, maybe they hold my, you know, big, big ass in there, so they, they work really good. Other than that, um, I got a Sparco steering wheel. This wing is a Voltex. Well, actually, it's a Jace racing wing. It's a Voltex wing. I actually, this is this is my custom-made uh, uh, gurney clap. It allows you to run, have the same amount of downforce at, with with less angle. So, if you didn't have this, I'd have to re um, run more angle or rake in the wing to get the same amount of downforce um, in this wing. So, um, but down the straightaway is something that you don't want because um, it's actually scrubbing off your speed. So, this is a great thing to have. Very inexpensive if you know how to make your own, but there's also people that sell it. So I, mean, I love this wing, it's great quality. I've had this for you know a couple of years now. It's a great carbon fiber. Um, very good product. Also, too, if you want to come around to the back side of the car, um, I have this homemade diffuser. A, a diffuser, what it does is cleans up the air um, behind your car. With the, with the vertical stocks the way they are, it actually um, streamlines the air. Sending allowed to tumble, it allows it to move more freely and smoothly, so it gets out underneath the car a lot faster. And that's how a diffuser works. That's basically my car in a nutshell. I mean, it's very basic. S2000s are very easy to take the track. I love this car. I love Hondas. Um, rice, you know, a ricer till I die, as you, you know, as you say. Um, so, yeah, that's that's my 2007 Honda S2000. And I'd like to see you guys at the next track of it.